New to the Portico WordPress theme um, is the Isotope uh, portfolio. And I may have seen this in a previous video where we were talking about placing this on a page. But uh, how it operates is it just animates certain items in and out of the page uh, based upon tags that are presented for this particular portfolio. So for example, each one of these images have water in them. And so we just organize it as such that you, you know, it's a river image. And you can show all just like this. And then you can also uh, click on to view that particular portfolio item. All right. So how do we get it within the page? Well, there's two ways. You can use the uh, short tag that's provided within the portfolio page that we give you. And it's simply I3D default portfolio. The other way is to, uh, on your page, if you wanted to, uh, contain a region instead of having a content area here. We would include, uh, we've got a custom area, region 3, which includes a portfolio widget, and that basically does the same thing. So the one thing about using a um, uh, for example, a, using the content region here is that you can flow text uh, above or below uh, this particular uh, widget if you wanted to say something special like, please enjoy our portfolio. You can do that and then at the bottom below that you can say, thank you for enjoying our port. Just as an example. Okay. And so that's, you know, the, the the reason for having a short code against just using a region that has the portfolio widget in it. Uh, as far as creating uh, portfolio items, we've included this in the, the, the menu on the left hand side and uh, for example you can add new if you wish. You can edit the ones that are there existing. You're going to want to give it a featured image by clicking over here if you don't have an image already. This is your product details, and this is the excerpt. The excerpt uh, is what dis is displayed when you hover over the image. Okay, and then when you were to go to view this portfolio item, this is the long description. Okay, as you can just see, long description, and um, and that's more or less all there is to it. If you want to add additional um, categories, for example, say we wanted this to be um, in the awesome category, we hit add. Make sure we hit update. We're going to hit back. And I don't know that it is, hasn't yet finished saving. Here we are. We have a new category called awesome, and it's that one photo. Okay. So that's how you go about adding additional categories in. If you want to manually um, manage those categories, you can do so by going to the portfolio. Uh, option itself and seeing um, you know this particular tag and you can give it a, a description if you want to but by default that's how it looks there okay and that's all there is to the um, portfolio um, custom post type and displaying it on the page and again just briefly one thing that I've glazed over in this particular video but I've shown in the intro video is that the custom region 2 has this new uh, widget that we've included called portfolio um, there's nothing to configure in this region at all uh, except that um, when it's displayed within a page, it will pull up that portfolio. Anyways, I hope that answers your questions.